Are you ready for episode two? I'm having so much fun playing with, praying at the speed of love. And I'm hearing from the people that I'm inviting to be on the show that they're excited to have this whole new kind of conversation. No one's ever asked them before. Come and talk to us. Let's have a real conversation about your intimate experiences with prayer. So you heard episode one with the odd guest of me, and I so appreciate your fun messages about hearing my stories. So episode two, who could be on the first other conversation? Well, the very first person that came to mind that very selfishly I want to hear her story is Emma Cooper Mitchell. If you've been in any of my intensives, you know that for several years now, even before the intensives and while I was still doing the courses, Emma would create the sacred anointing oils for us. And she does this in communion with the plants. This woman is a plant medicine goddess. She receives very clear divine instructions and speaks directly to the plants to receive the wisdom of exactly what should go in these blends. And it's always a stunner. It's always a complete surprise to her, to me. And then we experience the capacity of this sacred medicine as we anoint our bodies with it to bring us into full vibration with the sacred intention of the intensive. And she's a numerologist, my numerologist. Because of Emma, I, I, I'm now entering into an awareness of the numeric vibration of the year. You know, we're in a three year, right? Well, the very fact that I write about 2019 being a sacred three, two plus one plus nine is a 12. And what does that mean? It, this all comes from Emma. And then she started to talk about astrology in our intensives. And we all just kind of went, what, what, what? So much so that we are now come April 8th going to have an intensive just about the moon. Look at this cool. This is the goddess super sharp painted for it. See, there we are dancing with the moon. And Emma and I are creating this exquisite numerology, astrology, plant medicine, prayer intensive called Moon and Me in 2019. So I wanted to talk to Emma on the show. I'm pretty sure you'd love to hear the question I'd love to hear. How do you go from being an Anglican in York, England, reading, I'm assuming, the Book of Common Prayer, to a plant medicine goddess in communion with the sacred land in Hawaii. It's such a hoot to hear her say aloha with a British accent. So Emma is just this wonder to me. It seems like no matter what mystical wisdom we're interested in, Emma is on it. And this is why I christened her, what, three months ago, four months ago? Not very long ago. I think we were in the middle of doing the very first intensive I ever did with Emma, Your Three Fields in 2019. And I was awakened in the middle of the night. Now, you know from my story, I'm used to being awakened in the middle of the night and told what I am. But I was told to tell Emma <laughs> that she's a soul essence alignment artist. So I sent her a text, said, I think, I think we need to have a chat. And she was thrilled to receive this umbrella because the woman is so multifaceted. And so Emma is as far as I know, I'm the first ever prayer artist. She's the first ever soul essence alignment artist. So of course she has to be my second guest on praying at the speed of love. And now we're gonna, I'm gonna ask every guest, teach us a prayer practice. Something that we can take into our hearts, our bodies, and, and do, and practice, and experience. So if you would like a tea tiny taste, not just the intellectual story, 
but then enter into Emma's world, well, I don't know what it's going to be, but she is going to introduce us to a prayer practice. I don't know if it's going to be a Hawaiian. I don't know. I don't know. That's the entire point of praying at the speed of love. Come and have another real conversation with a real person about real prayer. And the real person is Emma Kupu Mitchell, my beloved friend and sacred sister and soul essence alignment artist in Hawaii, joining us on Praying at the Speed of Love, episode two.